One of the benefits of the rainy season in South Florida is that we don't have to worry so much about watering our lawns. But we do need to remember that every yard and neighborhood is connected to water resources. I'm Sarah Taylor, Master Gardener and member of the Keep Port St. Lucie Beautiful Committee. Let's talk about rainstorms and how the runoff can affect our environment. Rain that flows off roads, roofs, gutters, and yards into stormwater drains and retention ponds is considered stormwater runoff. Pollutants such as excess fertilizer and pesticides can enter water bodies through runoff. A healthy, properly maintained lawn and landscape can absorb and filter runoff helping to protect Florida's waters. Following these Florida-friendly landscaping guidelines will reduce pollution coming from the landscape. Rain gardens are shallow areas that are planted with grasses and other plants to filter water before letting it flow naturally into the ground. Rain gardens work best when they're placed at the bottom of downspouts or in places where water tends to puddle. If your roof has gutters, aim the downspouts at a porous surface so water can soak into the soil. To prevent water from pooling next to your home's foundation, extend downspouts further out into the yard and create a depressed area to collect storm water in a rain garden for infiltration. Use porous materials whenever possible such as brick, gravel, or mulch for walkways, driveways, and patios. These materials allow rainwater to seep into the ground. In some cases, these porous materials may even cost less to install than concrete or asphalt. Institute the concept of earth shaping, which is the creation of swales and berms located perpendicular to a slope to help capture or slow runoff that would otherwise rush from your yard. Rain barrels can capture a significant amount of water and can have a tangible effect on your water bill. Use the captured water to hand water your plants or install a seep irrigation system. Water kept within the landscape helps to replenish Florida's water supply, reduce pollutants, and keep Port St. Lucie beautiful.